It's Thursday. Going to solve the Thursday puzzle. I had a couple days hiatus, but I'm back. I hope you're ready to watch. I guess you are. You, after all, click to watch this video. So here we go. Let's solve this puzzle, shall we? Michael Lieberman is the constructor. My name is Steve. If you know me, that's because this is Solve with Steve. If you're new here, welcome. Going to solve the puzzle. Going to have some fun. It's Thursday. There's usually something, 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 a little something going on. What's going to happen? Let's find out. Here we go. Apparatus and CPR training is a defibrillator. Uh, let's go with that. Go with or maybe it's a dummy. I don't know. Um, Swan Lake will be the Bolshoi uh, with the ballet company, probably following the buddy system in twos, in pairs. How about that? Like some handshake, a firm handshake. Bird with vestigial wings is an emu, flightless waterfowl. Fist bump, dap. Uh, let's see, amino acid. Yep, colorful green is purple rice? Purple corn? I don't know. Uh, services at a mega church, mass. I like mass masses or something like that. I don't know. Wishful words. I hope. What's eso? That in Spanish is eso. Okay. Makeshift money is scrip. Uh, art style with Henri Rousseau. I don't know. Uh, back then, once, back in the day, a bound is to team. There's so much mass item, something like that. Bean pole material. Is it cane? I mean, that is a material. A uh, word that looks like an alternative to tisn't, snot, as in it's not. Um, you may think that gross stuff coming out of your nose is funny, but it's not. Okay, I couldn't resist. Okay, um, naive art style. I don't know about that. that. Doesn't say. Oh, massive, massive masses. I guess that works. Naive is an art style. Okay, uh, nativism. Right? Wasn't that okay? Well, let's go with my naive. Uh, sorry, massive masses. Okay, kid. I don't know. Ballpark figures are uh, are estimates. Are guesses. Are uh, I don't know. Occasion to share dirt. Oh, um, uh, tea, uh, gossip session, gossip tea, tea session, tea session, I guess that works, tea session, I don't know, traditional Mexican stew, don't know, too bad, I don't know, Blank Valley, the Garden of France, is it Loire Valley, I think that's the thing, Department of Labor Division, let's go with OSHA, that seems a bit, strike one, uh, omit, delete, deal, prep for major renovation, say, I don't know, occasion share, oh, gossip, this is definitely gossip something, okay, ballpark figures are, oh, ushers, like people who work at the ballpark, ah, good one, okay, kid is to tease, Prep for major renovation. Yep, you got it, and then you renovate. Okay, strike one. Strike a pose. That's what you strike. All right, uh, traditional Mexican stew. I don't know. Posote? For some reason, I don't know about that. Too bad. Alas. Uh, resells on game day is scalps. The ticket pos posole? I don't know. Um, sorghum is is like it's like a it's a grain, right? Is it? A, I don't know. Why not? Uh, I don't know. Um, List in a fancy witchcraft guide. Something cursive. Cursive curses. So we have something with an I V E and then something with an E S. Gossip sesh. Sesh like that. I don't know. Second site would be ESP. College department might pay students to be test subjects. Would be the psychology uh, department. Not test subjects. Participants. They're called participants. Okay. Uh, a Spanish 101 verb is ser. Uh, ser. Uh, the most important architect our age would be Frank Gehry. What well, attention is so passes passive passes? That's what we have here. What is the what is the reveal? Okay, translate whose tra name translates as bitter. I don't know. Boundless as vast as anise. Uh, expressionist painter Nolde Enid. It fits. Cleveland hoops would be a cav. Not oh a natto maybe. Ah, what do we have here? Uh, why not? Sure, anar. Oh, I don't know about the sorghum. Crap, I don't think is right. <laughs> Crep, crip, crop. Oh, it's a crop. It's something you grow. Okay. Anaro. Amaro. I don't know about this Enid. Uh, that's going to. Okay. We'll come back to that. Uh, lead into sphere. Uh, biosphere. Cryophobes fear. You're afraid of coldness. Ice. Um, using those those Latin or Greek prefixes. Okay. Gala garb would be a tux. We're a tux. Uh, exosphere is uh, outer space. Uh, okay. Foretold is pro. Uh, IT Pro is a bug specialist, as in as in bugs with their computer. Okay, foretold is pro pa, 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 pro prophesied, prophesied. S wait for past tense. We need D. This one should be a an S or a C. Uh, I th for some reason, I think the noun is a prophecy with an S with a C. I'm thinking the verb would be. I'm not sure, but that could be cool. Experiment seen in. Uh, let's just leave it by. 
experiments in Oppenheimer are A tests, atomic tests. Uh, organization seeking alien life is the search for extraterrestrial intelligence, SETI. Uh, historical setting and everything sought in everything is illuminated. Uh, is the shtetl. I was saying he was going back to his, uh, to his hometown trying to find his roots. Um, Emil, Emil Nold it? That, that seems to fit. Amaro. I like Amaro better than. Also, uh, Amaro was the, uh, the, uh, the, the guy in Law and Order. He was the uh, one of the uh, uh, on SVU, one of the one of the detectives. Okay, uh, fall in winter is sleet. I get it. Fall in winter. Okay, uh, some sandals are. Sl I don't know. If you blank, what the rock is cooking? Oh boy, uh, I don't know. I stopped watching wrestling before the rock, um, so I know who he is, but I don't know his catchphrase. Uh, I remember Hulkamania's running wild, but I don't remember what the rock is cooking. Okay, long letters are missives. Missive misses are long letters written to the sense of the wrong person. Cut and paste is our edit. Wine dregs are the lees. Uh, acid is LSD, uh, the drug. Uh, some samples are slides. Yes, if you smell what the rock is cooking. I don't know. That seems like there should be something after that. All right, what do we got over here? Defame is to, I don't know. Uh, shoes, slangly are your kicks. Those are specifically your sneakers, right? Uh, sort of, ish. Uh, way back when, ago, ago, ages ago. There we go. Uh, like a Zen garden vis-a-vis -a, -vis a zoo. Uh, serener. Oh, a Zen garden is like, it's peaceful. A zoo is, oh, this place is a zoo. Okay. Uh, airmen's superiors would be sergeants in the Air Force, right? Um, very beginning is the, the get-go from the get-go. Name on a poster for the Magnificent Ambersons. Is it Orson? That's like Orson Welles. Uh, seems like it would fit. Oxford figure. Uh, I don't know. Something a barb can hurt your ego. The old me is gone. I've changed. <laughs> uh, the I-V-E changes to S. I've changed. <laughs> okay, good one. One managing moguls is a skier. The bumps on the on the ski, ski slopes. To defame is to smear. Uh, sometime is ever and have good chemistry is to vibe with yeah boo -ba -doo -ba -doo -boo -doo. all right that was fun uh <laughs> i've changed so yeah so so the the theme here we have four phrases where there's a word ending in ive and then the same word but the ive changes to es um so we have massive masses church services uh, at a mega church, there'd be lots and lots of people. Although, no, I'm hardly an expert on mega churches um, or on masses. But it, in my experience, a mass is something that's done in the Catholic Church or in the the, the mainstream, like the uh, the Anglican Church. They do masses, right? Um, or, sorry, the what do we call it? Episcopalian. Um, they have they have the mass. To my knowledge, the 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 more, for lack of a word, contemporary Christian. Uh, that you associate with the mega churches, I don't believe they have masses. Correct me if I'm wrong, please. In the comments, correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but I always thought of a mass as more of a traditionalist thing, uh, with the whole uh, 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 you know the the communion and the uh, I don't know. I, I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Anyhow, um, cursive curses. Uh, list any fancy witchcraft guide. So cursive is uh, fancy because they're writing in old and curses they have witchcraft and again the I V E turns into E S uh, passive passes the tentative quarterback right you throw a pass but you're not quite sure about it you're probably gonna get picked off but uh, the, the I V E changes to an E S and finally missive misses again the I V E a missive is a long long letter. Uh, but if it's a miss, because you sent it to the wrong person, if it's a missive miss, and then the plural. So missive misses, and then the revealer, I've changed, the old me is gone. What happened? To the I've changed to S, which doesn't quite work. But I've changed, so the, the I-V-E changes. Very well done, very well done. I like this one a lot. Um, is there anything that I learned? Oh, I didn't do the last couple. Cardinal point is beak. Oh, we think the cardinal point is like north, south, east, west. But in this case, the cardinal would be the bird, the cardinal, and it has a little pointed beak there. And what is errs? Makes a mistake. Slips is errs. Okay. Or errs. I don't know. Okay. Uh, I'm guessing this is Orson Welles. The Magnificent Ambersons can't say that. No. Purple rice. Now, that's not... Uh, I got to look up purple rice. That, apparently, that's a thing. Um, it, it's not part of the theme. It's just a nice little 10-letter thing that they... that uh, Who is it? Michael Lieberman 
found and, and put in the puzzle for us. Thank you, Michael Lieberman. Uh, but I like that a lot. Uh, yeah. All righty. So let's let's do that. Let's uh, let's switch over to uh, what was it? The magnificent, the magnificent Ambersons. That's got to be an old movie with Orson Welles, right? All right. The here we go. The mag. Magnificent Seven, the Magnificent. Does that show up for you guys? No, it doesn't show up. Ah, the Magnificent M persons. The magnificent Arrow. Oh, look at this. Orson Welles shows up right there. Okay, there it is. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh, all right. So there we have. It. I'm not familiar with the Magnificent. I'm not going to watch it tonight. Just so you know. But I might put that on the list. You know, sometimes I get some watching recommendations from from the puzzle because why not? Uh, I suppose I could ask my friends, relatives, <laughs> look at IMDb and see what the highest rated things are. No, I'll solve what was in the puzzle. Uh, actually, that is how I watched Get Out. Cause, or um, not actually, yes, that is how I watched Get Out, which was really really good. But it was in the puzzle. I'm like, oh, I heard that. I wanted to see it. It was really good. Um, anyway, all right. I hope that you enjoyed that. Uh, yeah, and I will not be editing this, but I had fun from the get-go, and I don't know if there's going to be a bonus uh, themer. I will I will try, but uh, this is very specific, so I don't know if there... If there is, then the clue, the title to this uh, to this video is the clue to the bonus themer. If not, th yeah, I don't know. I will... Uh, I'll give it a little bit of thought, but no, no promises. No promises. I had fun solving this puzzle. I hope you did too. Hey, I haven't been begging people, but please subscribe. All right, if you've already subscribed, tell a friend to subscribe. Uh, if all of your friends have subscribed, wow, I'm impressed. Um, get out there and make new friends and tell them to subscribe. Uh, but I would love to love to collect subscribers and uh, and likes and of course comments. If you have something to say, please please say it. And I will see you in the future. Got the weekend coming up, not that far from now. And I will see you in the future. Have a wonderful day.